We begin tonight with the breaking news in New Jersey. Two children found dead in the back seat of a car. They were restrained in their car seats, their hands bound, and tonight their mother is facing murder charges. CBS 2's Corey James live at the scene with details on who found them and what the police are saying tonight. Corey. And Marisa Christine, it was a tow truck driver who found them. We spoke with that driver's father who says his son just happened to be driving in the area when he saw a car in the ditch. And when he walked up to offer help, he was stunned by what he saw inside. He was shook up. Robert Long is describing the frantic phone call he got from his son early Tuesday morning after his son, a tow truck driver, found a woman and two dead children in the backseat of a car that ran off the road near Mountain View Road in Hillsboro, New Jersey. He said he found he found a lady in, in, in the ditch and he said, uh, asked her if she was all right. She said no, I think. And then he seen the babies, you know, and then he called the cops right away. The Somerset County Prosecutor's Office says that 911 call was made just before 8 o'clock. When officers arrived, they found a 7-year-old and 10-month-old in their booster seat who were bound, restrained, and not breathing. Authorities say their mother, 36-year-old UHO, killed them. That's just sick. I don't I don't know how you can do that. Cho has been charged with two counts of first-degree murder and will be booked in the Somerset County Jail after a medical evaluation. That's good. And authorities have identified the children as Samantha Ross, who was seven years old, and Paul Ross, who was 10 months old. Their cause of deaths have not been confirmed at this time and is still under investigation. Right now, a motive is also not known. We're live in Hillsborough, New Jersey. Corey James, CBS 2 News. Okay, Corey, thank you. And